This is an awesome little way um, to clean out your grout, make it look like new without actually having to put in any kind of elbow grease. What's going on guys, I'm Bill and welcome to Bill's How To. Today I'm going to show you guys how to clean the grout lines on your shower cubicle. Now in this case here we can see it's discolored all the way down. We've got a bit of mold growing on there and this has been left for a fairly long period of time. So as you can tell, pretty much all the grout lines are pretty dirty and they need to be cleaned up. So rather than scrubbing away and trying to clean this here out or removing the grout and replacing it with a new one, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys a little trick um, to clean all of this up. Um, we've also got some silicon that's discolored. Now generally this trick also works for silicon. However, in this case here, you can see it's actually yellow and that means it's discolored because it's a uh, very old clear silicon that was applied a very long time ago. So either way, I'm going to apply the silicon, uh, the, the chemical along this side here as well. And we're going to try and see how far we can penetrate into that silicon. But as we come down here, you can see that's pure mold down the bottom. Um, and we've got a few different types of silicon that we use. So if you notice, the bottom two rows of tiles are different to the rest. The reason for that is they've had some waterproofing issues here in the past. They've had to remove the bottom course of tiles, re-waterproof it, and then re-tile it. So you can see here we've got some new silicon in the corner, or fairly new anyway compared to the rest, um, but that's a good indicator that they've had issues with waterproofing here. Now I'm going to be using my little trick, which this little product here, it's basically a bleach solution. Now this one here works pretty well. However, in this case here, um, this is an empty bottle that I've refilled up with a concentrated bleach solution. So, I prefer to dilute it one to one. This one here, for example, is a 1.25 litre. Says it makes up to 50 litres, so that means one to 50. So one part of this chemical, or the uh, dilute concentrated bleach, to 50 parts of water. Now, what I generally do, especially when we've got situations like this, one to one is what I do. It's just the concentrated bleach that's in this bottle, um, but this product here also works very, very well as well, and it's pretty cheap. The reason why I go for this product or a concentrated bleach apart, um, uh, opposed to a regular bleach is not only is it stronger because it's concentrated, but it's also thicker. And having it thicker means it's gonna be able to cling to the surface a lot better than what regular diluted bleach would. If you can imagine, it's watery, so it's gonna just run down the wall and it's not gonna sit on the affected area for very long. So what I'm gonna do, open this bottle here up, and we're basically going to apply it to all the grout lines all the way around in this shower cubicle here, including all the silicon around the edges. And I'm going to let this one here set, um, sit overnight. So I'm going to apply this now, and then I'll come back tomorrow and I'll show you guys just how much of a difference we have. So we're just going to apply this to all the grout lines. You can see it's a bit thicker than what your regular bleach would be. Make sure we cover all those grout lines. including the silicon along the side here. Now, like I said, this clear silicon, I'm not expecting it uh, to come back up the way it was. More than likely, I'm gonna have to cut that silicon out and replace it with some new one, which will make it look a lot nicer anyway. So don't be shy, this stuff is pretty cheap. Apply it, we'll get a good result and avoid having to do any kind of scrubbing. This is pretty strong smelling, so you do want to apply it and then run. A Little bit more on the outside here. All right, now we'll just let this one here set and we'll come back tomorrow and I'll show you guys the results. All right guys, so we're back the following day and this is the result. So all we did was just apply bleach, leave it overnight and come back and have a look at this. We've got about 95% of the mess has gone, if not more. If we have a quick look at some of the areas that we had in the previous footage, so just above these two tiles here, this little section here is a chip. Um, so 
pretty much this section here um, is what I had on the main section of the other footage um, and you can see most of that has actually gone now there are some areas that look like they're still a little bit dirty that's not actually the case and I'll show you guys what's going on if we come in nice and close here you can see the old grout lines now this hasn't deteriorated over time this isn't the result of um, just wear and tear over time what's happened here is when this grout was installed it wasn't installed properly so you can see there it doesn't have a nice smooth finish all the way across they've done a really rough job and as a result they've left a rough grout so that means that it's nice and textured it pops out it protrudes and that means it's got a little ledge or a little area for mold and dirt and everything else to just sit there and build up so that's exactly what's happening here and that's the cause of it um, but if we have a look at the rest of the areas some areas that might look a little bit dirty same thing here we've got a little bit of grout missing and you can actually see the side of the tile so if we have a look on this side here there's a few better examples if we have a look on top of there it's actually the top or the the inside sorry of the tile so that's where this this colored um, area is actually coming from but overall this is actually looking really really nice now um, especially because i didn't have to scrub it didn't have to put in much effort basically just apply the bleach leave it um, overnight and it does it, its own little magic um, in regards to the silicon so pretty much as I was expecting it hasn't actually cleaned off any of the silicon especially the clear silicon um, this one here is yellow so that means it's deteriorated it's just very very old and that's the reason why this one here is discolored as we come down this one here is just pure mold um, there's no way we're going to get rid of this without removing the silicon and then reinstalling some new ones so I'm about to do that now this one here is an awesome little trick to get you guys out of trouble, no elbow grease required, bit of bleach, apply it on there, walk away, come back the following day and your bathroom's ready to go. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed the video, as always like, comment and subscribe, until next time I'm Bill, thanks for watching Bill's Out Too.